Y'all, that is not a hiding place. You're a place that I want y'all to play. Because if you knock my curtain down, it's going to be a bad day for both of you. <laughs> ZJ. <laughs> he just won't come out of <laughs> And believe it or not, you guys, this is not forced. This is like something that, okay, he's done. This is something that they enjoy doing with each other. They love playing with each other. It's just, it's crazy. Like, it's not crazy to have a bond the way that they have. Um, I just never would have expected it. I, I hear more about it than I see it. So, being able to see it in person, you know, it's just, it's so cool. I mean, literally, they play with each other on their own. And they have fun with each other. He looks for her and she looks for him. And when they're away from each other, they come back to, to each other. Like, even if it's for a couple of hours, they come back to each other like this was, like they've been away from like two weeks or something. It's just, it's cool to have a bond like that. Like, that's amazing. At the age difference, because I mean, she's six and he's nine months. So, who has the ball? So, um, yeah. The toad guy just finally got here. And we have no idea what's wrong with her. It's probably, Turgy feels like it's the fuel pump, but we won't know until, um, we just won't know. <laughs> until we can get it to the shop, but we're not gonna leave it in the parking lot. So we're having it towed back to our house. Um, but we have been out here since maybe six, six or seven maybe. And it is 11 o'clock now. So yeah, that's how long we have waited for the tow truck to come. And that is through our insurance. I'm gonna tell you something that's crazy right now. Just seeing my car <laughs> being put on the back of this truck makes me completely sad inside because I love my car. <laughs> and it's like, I know she's sick. And it's just so sad. It's like, like, it, like it's my kid or something like, I know you probably, guys probably think that is the stupidest thing, Amy, and it probably is, and I'm probably emotional because I'm a girl, and, you know, girls have a lot of hormones, but it makes me completely sad seeing her, it's like she's helpless, and I can't do anything for her, but it's like she's being lifted on an ambulance, you know, and... I know that sounds so stupid, but my heart is just kind of like aching for her right now. Like, literally my heart is aching. I probably need to just go to bed, but this makes me so sad. It makes me sad. Look at her, she's my baby. That's my pocket car, you know? And right now she's broken and, you know, 
I don't know what's wrong with her. I am actually vlogging from my phone and you can really tell the quality. So I'm a I'm gonna start trying a whole lot more to vlog from my actual from my camera because I do have a camera. But anyway, I wanted to come on here real quick. It is 12:15 and we just got home to show you the time. It's 12:15 in the morning, so it is officially Saturday morning. And we just got home. My car is out in the driveway. She is home. Um, yeah, so I don't know what's wrong with it yet. We'll find out later whenever we can get her into the shop. But my husband seems to think it probably is the fuel pump. Um, but he's not sure. I thought maybe starter, but he said no, it's turning. So it's not like it's not getting any ignition. It's like it's turning. It just won't fire up. Um, it's not the battery. <laughs> we just replaced the battery in it. Um, and everything comes on. So the lights are working. The um, uh, windows coming out, radios on. So I did turn all of that stuff off just to be safe. But yeah, we've been out there for a while. I don't even really know what time I actually called my called husband. Me a little bit after seven. They called in. Yeah. Let me let me show Bye. you guys. Okay, I called you what time? Uh, about 7.30. 730. And then they made the first call about a little bit after 8. And we're just getting home when it's 12.15. 12 yeah, so we're both exhausted. Like, Babe was in the bed, if y'all couldn't tell. The, the covers were folded back. I literally <laughs> yeah, I went to go. I told him, I said, I need to go get some soap. <laughs> and... Um, because I forgot to get it while we were out. And I've been out all day, y'all. Like, I literally have. I've been out all day. I have not been out, like, all day. But I went out this afternoon. I've had it on the highway. She's Well, she was fine. Like, she was fine. She didn't give me any type of feeling like she was getting sick. And Babe drove it last week. Babe drove it this week because of the heat. His heat in his car is not working. So he drove it and he put it on the highway too. And what's so funny is, is that we have three cars. Okay. The hubby has an expedition. I have Pathfinder. And then I have that, my pocket car, which is the bug. And we're down to one. <laughs> we're down one car I mean, so, two of them working we just got the other one on loan oh yeah <laughs> Cause so I yeah because Kena is having issues with her car too so she has the pathfinder and it's gonna be like, an interesting just, next week it's crazy it's crazy what's up y'all Nia's hubby decided to come out today um, and go look at a few cars um, and, and not looking at cars because we're having car problems, but we were always gonna, we've, we've been on the search to get something new um, for a minute now. So we was just out searching to see what we like. Um, and we went to look at the um, Hyundai, Hyundai GV80 and then we also went to look at the smaller body Cadillac so I think it's Cadillac XT5 <clears throat> I really didn't like the Cadillac um, and pretty much the ones that they had on the lot did not have any type of sunroof moonroof or anything um, the now I must say that the Cadillac not the Cadillac but the the Hyundai um, GV80 it's a nice car. It's a really nice car. If you're not looking for like a huge SUV, um, it gives you enough room and you get enough like um, space in the back as well for trunk. So it's really nice.
what you're doing. Why is it the meat thing? Huh? Yeah, he's trying to get the... I don't know what you should call it. Cooking, cooking. What are you cooking in here? Uh, cube steak. No. It'll be smothered in gravy after I make the gravy after I finish. Green beans. I'm going to turn those into cream potatoes. And the cornbread I'm making a little bit. Yum. Sunday fun day. Oh, yeah. Sunday fun day. And uh, this one is begging to go outside. And then he won't stay out there once you get him out there. But he will this time, because I'm going to shut the door. So, yeah. Hubby is in the kitchen cooking. So, it's got some cute steak frying, some green beans, and some... He's making cream potatoes, which is honestly so good. I can't wait to eat. <laughs> Me, too. Me too. So yeah, you guys are probably wondering like, what's the update on the car? But we don't have anything right now. We won't know anything until later on this week, more than likely with the car. So, um. She is outside in the front yard, chilling, and um, she'll be there until we get her situated. Um, I think yesterday I was talking to you guys about a car, but um, me and hubby just went out, just looking at different cars. We've, we've been in the search now for um, another vehicle. And um, right now we have a total of three. Yeah, three vehicles. <clears throat> so he drives an Expedition. I have the Bug as a little ride around car. And then we have Nissan Pathfinder. And so um, his Expedition is an older Expedition and he drives it to work, but it, it is also with the gas prices, a gas guzzler. And um, it, it needs a lot of work done to it. Plus with his um business um he's going to be doing a lot of moving around and stuff like that so he'll be going to different sites and you have a lot of stuff that he'll need to actually tow so um we need something more reliable for him so we was just you know just kind of searching we don't have right now an idea of what we want we're just looking to see what is out there. Y'all, this thing right here just popped up out of nowhere and it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. And I'm just like, what in the world? Like in the middle of my face at that. Like it, it has no shame in its game and it hurts. Um, yeah, I have no idea where that come from. Yes, I have on my bonnet. I still have on my wig cap from earlier. <laughs> Um, from what I was showing you guys, I came downstairs because I just wanted to kind of chill down here, um, see what I could get into on TV. Really nothing. I've just been over there chilling on the recliner, watching the Hunger Games. And um, nothing too exciting is going on this Sunday. I thought I was going to have to do Winter's Hair, but I think her mom is just going to tackle it for today, which is so fine with me because I do not like doing her hair because she is so tender-headed it is a task and a half to do her hair y'all know i talk about that all the time it's a task um zj he will sit there and let you comb his hair when it is tangled and not a cry in the world winter if you just touch a strand will scream so they're, they're, they're night and day and it's just it's aggravating so i'm, I'm kind of glad that <laughs> i don't have to do it today see if you want to say daddy I love you guys. <laughs> Pray for me. Why? Because I got my daughter car broke, my wife's little push and go broke, and we praying that big blue don't break. She holding on. I think it's going to be all right, though. Just one of them things.